Whoa. Whoa! Right? Nice chisel point right there. Super beautiful. Check out this gorgeous piece. Wow! What's up, Crystal family? Today we got a really exciting video for you guys. We are at Fisher Mountain and we are gonna dig a pocket today. We got Jesse as our tour guide here and we got Jennifer with us too. So let's get started. Okay, so this is the spot we're gonna dig today. As you can see, there's some beautiful crystals right here in between those rocks. Oh wow, that one just popped out. Tiny little crystal, but you can see all of those amazing points. And Jesse's been starting to open it up a little bit for us. So we can get at those clusters and points. Looking good. We got this beautiful cluster already loosened up here. Just took a few minutes and Jesse's about to pry it off. Wow, now this is a beautiful cluster right here. See all the points already? This big piece looks like it's mostly rock, but it's got some nice crystals here on the side that we may actually just be able to pull off like that. So they don't seem attached, look at that. That's Fisher Mountain Ice right there. Wow, look at that little crystal attached. Super beautiful. And there it is. Always good to not wiggle out the points individually, but try to get the whole plate. Oh wow. Beautiful. Since that's already loose, I can kind of just pull it. Is it, is it okay? Yeah, you, you could if you'd like to. Look at all that clay behind it too, so it's mm. been loose for a long time. Beautiful. All right, so we have this beautiful pocket right here. And I'm gonna remove some more of this rock right in front of it so we can face it off right. The nice thing about this location, I don't know why exactly, I guess there's been a lot of earth movement or something, but the rock here is really easy to work. It's like in layers and it just comes off. Tip right there, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Glass bag cluster right there. That's how we like them. Oh yeah, that's a killer piece. Mm -hmm. And here it is after first rinse. This one is definitely the best piece of the dig. It's got that incredible double terminator just sitting right on top there. Whew. And we got this whole thing loose with that big point that we discovered a few minutes ago. Here we go. Oh yeah, that's, that seems to be a pretty decent plate right here. Fairly oh. solid. Wow. And these are probably that's all loose. Man, look at that. Mm. And this is probably a little glass bag sitting on top here. Let's do the reveal. Nice. I'm not gonna peel, peel at the clay too much to keep these things protected, but we'll check it out when it's all rinsed off. It shed a little bit on that side there, but overall, a beautiful plate. Look at those gorgeous crystals. So we've been moving some rock here in front of this pocket, and as you can see, the whole thing is moving. All right. Oh, well, put that and over. look 
Look at that. You can see all those beautiful big points. Some of them are going to be loose, but hopefully this will turn out to be a nice cluster. And here it is after a rinse. This one did end up shedding a lot of its points, which is just due to natural earth movements and natural breaking. And it's still pretty nice. So this beautiful big one just came off of that plate. Let's give it a wipe. That's beautiful. That's incredible. That is super clear. Beautiful. There you go. Super neat. So when you are digging a pocket up here at Fisher Mountain, you can expect to pay at least a thousand dollars. That would be the starting price point for these pockets. And you will receive about four or five baskets of crystals that you can hand dig. Now, if you find something extremely special and valuable, you will get a little less than four baskets because the pieces that you find are being evaluated as you dig. And if you want to continue digging and spend more than a thousand dollars, you can also do that. And you get to dig in an untouched area, virgin crystals that have never been pulled out. This is exactly how they were formed in the ground and you are the first one to mine these out here when you do a pocket dig. You will have a tour guide with you for the whole dig. We had Jesse today and he's been a great help. They will assist you in digging and extracting the crystals and they will evaluate the crystals as they come out of the ground so they have an approximate idea of how much value you're getting. So it's pretty cool because you get a unique experience up here. You can kind of hang out with the miners and get a different look at how this whole mining industry works here in Arkansas. Look at that. Mm. That's a trip right there. I mean, look at this crystal just mm. jumbled up in there. Beautiful point. Beautiful points everywhere. And here it is after a quick cleanup. It's a beautiful plate. And look at this thing. I don't know where it came from, but it's just hanging out here. Wow. And it's actually a beautiful twin. Look at that. Beautiful. There we go, after a quick rinse. Nice twin point. Just look at all these crystals. Here's a nice candle point. Loaded. What are you finding? Points, little points. Lots of points. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All goes in the bucket. And look at this view up here. Let's pull this one out. Look at that. Ooh, pretty. Nice rainbow on that. Look at that. Mm. Oh, that's beautiful, wow. It's got that amazing window right there, which makes it a seven-sided crystal. Beautiful. Did you just pull that one? Yeah. That's a beauty. This one is quite a beauty, super clear, nice point, and it's even self-healed. Another beauty. That one is crazy because it's like a tabby. Wait, I think I'm getting more. Wow. They almost seem like they would go together. These two, they probably mm -hmm. grew right next to each other. All right, so here's these two beauties that Jennifer just pulled. And she's still going at it. About to pull another one, it looks like. Nice. We got a few handfuls here. Let's see what they are. This one looks promising. Oh, yeah, that's definitely got some nice points in there. Beautiful. Look at that. All right. Look at that beauty, too. 
nice miniature clusters. I love these because they are like little perfect crystal cities. Super nice pieces. What have you found? Oh my goodness. Huh? Nice big point. Beautiful. We got this beautiful piece loose. Let's see. Here it is. Wow. Ooh, that looks solid too. Nice glass bag. Look at that. All crystallized. Beautiful points on it. Oh my gosh. Wait until you see the bag. <laughs> Let me clean it up a little. <laughs> Make it presentable. Whoa. Whoa! Right? That was unexpected. Wow. Nice chisel point right there. That's the best cluster so far. Awesome. And this one kind of turned out to be super unique. Beautiful piece. All right, here we go. And here's that piece all cleaned up. Another nice cluster, thin back, beautiful. Another beautiful cluster we just pulled. It's got some really unique features on this one. All right, check out this gorgeous piece, wow. And here it is after a little bit of a cleanup. Got an interesting key right there where another crystal used to sit. It's getting a handful of points right now. And look at this big one and this big one. Nice. Beautiful point. So here's the most recent pulls. Check out this nice DT that we just pulled out. Sweet. So we have finished taking this pocket and let's go rinse them off. Okay, so from the pocket deck we got two baskets of dirt with a bunch of beautiful crystal points in it. And then we got one and a half buckets of wrapper pieces, which hopefully those will be clusters. And we'll unload all of this on the table right now and give it a rinse. Okay, so here's a quick overview of all the beautiful crystals from the pocket dig after a good rinse. As you can see, there is tons of crystal points. Now the question is, did we get a thousand points? We are going to be counting these here in just a minute. And that would be quite amazing. But as you can tell, these are just phenomenal. Look at this amazing twin crystal right here. So many nice pieces. I mean, every one of these is a beauty. The cool thing is there's no two crystals that are alike. It's kind of like our fingerprint. Every crystal is unique. And then of course we got some nicer smaller clusters. And we got some pretty nice big pieces that actually stay together. And here's the mini clusters laid out so you can get a better idea of how they look. The nice thing is a lot of these stand up perfectly. Beautiful. The amazing thing about the crystals at Fisher Mountain is the exceptional quality. Look at this handful of jewelry points. They are just glassy, clear, icy, nice luster. Look at this awesome little jewelry point. It's got a perfect cross. Here's another exceptional cluster in perfect condition. And of course, it's a glass back. Quite the unique formation there. Check out this crazy point. Wow. Look at this awesome crystal right here. This is one of the master crystals. We call this a bridge crystal or penetrator crystal. As you can see, it's got this little side crystal right here that is growing right into 
the main point and it throws some beautiful rainbows in there. Here's another beautiful crystal with a window. Beautiful diamond window. That's about as perfect as they get. Hey Punky, what's your favorite? You like one of those? Gorgeous. Beautiful thick points. Alright, so here's all the crystals flatted up from the dig. These are all good points or clusters with points on them. We have some larger lower grade pieces and two flats of small lower grade clusters. Then we have a flat of amazing high grade pieces right there. We got two flats of beautiful, perfect little miniature clusters. And then we got lots and lots of single points in all sizes. As you can see, there's gonna be a lot of jewelry material and a lot of small crystals. Here's some more beautiful ones. And another flat of good small points. We got a half flat of some milky stuff, but with good tips. And then of course we have the three bigger clusters of the day. So there you have it. This is the pocket dig at Fisher Mountain. So the last thing left to do is let's go ahead and count those points and let's see how many we actually dug up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 311, 312, 313, 314, 315, 316. 990, 991, 992, 993, 994, 995, 996, 997, 998, 999, 1000. 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005, 1006, 1007, 1008, 1009, 1010, 1011, 1012, 1013, 1014, 1015, 1016, 1017, 1018, 1019, 1020. Oh my goodness, I still have this whole flat to go. We definitely got over a thousand points been an amazing time i hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks so much for watching make sure to smash that subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video aloha